someone's experiencing some peaceful meditations. This morning wasn't a deep, stable, cool peacefulness like yesterday, but it was peaceful, and then there was flashes of light, and the flashes of light were different intensities, and uh, the meditator got distracted by the light, and then when the noise level increased, uh, the light wasn't there anymore, so is the mind playing tricks on me? So, you know, light is just another one of those things that can occur when the mind's becoming peaceful, so. And it's the, it's the same instruction is, the mind's beginning to become peaceful because it's with its meditation object. So basically you stay with the meditation object. And some people are more visual, some people are less visual. And it's just like if you're walking, doing walking meditation and you're feeling peaceful but you still see sights. You're just aware of seeing. It's actually still the seeing consciousness but it's working on a more subtle level. So it's the mind seeing. And um, if we try to send the mind out to visions or lights, concentration usually gets scattered and the meditation is not peaceful anymore. And if you just stay with the awareness of the breath and it gets more and more subtle, for some people a light gets brighter and brighter and brighter, but they're with the breath. And then if the breath goes, for some people that light becomes the object of meditation, but it happens by itself. So you just with the breath, with the breath, with the breath until it gets more and more subtle and then if, a, if that light becomes very, very bright, and some people's minds then take the light as the meditation object, but the breath is what leads it in. This is what, I don't have this experience, but others, I've heard this from others. If you try to hold on to the light, it'll, if it's coming from the breath meditation, there's different types of light visualizations as well, casinas, I don't have any experience of that, but I know some people, when they're practicing breath meditation, do get a light, nimitta, many people, often white or gold. But if the mind's getting a little bit peaceful, it's, it's different flashes, white, gold, orange, are very common, sometimes red, sometimes purple. I've heard many people report this when they're becoming a little bit peaceful, they get flashes of light. But it's a good sign. It means that the mind is more sensitive and more concentrated, and it's not, it's not playing tricks on you. It's just one of those things that can happen other people, when the mind gets peaceful like that, if they're sensitive, they can actually start to see beings in parallel realms. I just kind of mention it in case it happens. And the reason I mention it is not because I want people to want it to happen. It's more like if it does happen, I, I want people not to be fascinated or frightened or overly concerned. In Buddhism, it's accepted that there are devas in trees, nagas in rivers, uh, ghosts, so these kind of beings are always there, we just can't see them with our ordinary eyes. And if the mind becomes more sensitive and uh, gets a bit more power, people can glimpse these things, but the same thing, stay with the breath, stay with the awareness of the breath, and uh, dedicate merit to all beings around in all directions. Basically try not to get fascinated and also try not to get scared. Just keep establishing the mindfulness. It's just visual consciousness on a more subtle, level. And uh, craving for those kind of experiences also obstructs peacefulness. So mindfulness, and it's just refining the mindfulness. So just as you, in the beginning of meditation, you get fascinated with your fantasies. As meditation in improves, you can get fascinated with visions. And so we have to stay clear, awake, mindful, focused, and just seeing, seeing back to the breath. and uh, if, But if the mind comes in, some people might start experiencing that, but if the mind is getting peaceful with the breath, you're losing perception of the breath and there is a bright light, don't be frightened of that. That's a sign, sometimes called a nimitta, that the mind is uh, becoming peaceful.